All Paseco machines require daily maintenance as specified in this video to maximise their life and avoid damage. If problems occur with your machine and to take the basic troubleshooting checks explained in this video before contacting your service agent for further assistance. Where indicated, please ensure you unplug the machine before carrying out any maintenance. After every use, switch off the machine and unplug the machine. Wrap the supply cord around the cable winder and handle and check the supply cord for any signs of damage. Loosely wrap the cord to prevent cord damage. Pull the handle down until it rests on the floor and the brush guard is raised. This will facilitate cleaning. If using a pad, firstly remove it from the drive board and check its condition, either discarding or storing it in a dry indoor area. Then remove the drive disc from the hub. If using a brush, rinse the brush under warm water and store it in a dry indoor area. Wipe down the brush guard area and the machine in general. Return the machine to the upright position. Never store the machine with a brush or drive board and pad fitted, as this can cause distortion and results in instability during operation. Always store the machine in a dry indoor area only. The handle can be folded for easy storage. An optional solution tank is available for improved productivity when scrubbing and shampooing with the Orbis Eco 200 and Duo models. If you're using this optional accessory, remove the water pipe from the base of the machine and direct it into a bucket. Using the water lever, release the remaining liquid until empty. Refill the solution tank with clean water and flush through into the bucket. Reconnect the water pipe to the base of the machine. If your machine doesn't work, turn off and unplug the machine. Check the supply cord and fuse for any signs of damage. Try in another plug socket outlet. If you're still experiencing problems, please contact your local service agent. If your machine is jumping or bouncing, turn off and unplug your machine. Remove the drive board and pad or brush, checking both items for damage. Check the hub and lugs for damage. If using a drive board and pad, replace the drive board, ensuring it is fitted correctly without over-rotating. Then check the pad is located centrally onto the drive board. Also make sure you're using the correct pad for the floor type you're cleaning. If using a brush, replace the brush ensuring it is fitted correctly without over-rotating. Check you are not using too much chemical. If you're still experiencing problems, please contact your local service agent. If the brush or drive board doesn't turn, remove your brush or pad and drive disc from the machine. Switch on the machine to check you can hear the motor running. If you can't hear the motor running, try the plug in another socket outlet and check the supply cord and fuse for damage. If you're still experiencing problems, please contact your local service agent. When using the optional solution tank, if no solution is being dispensed onto the floor, check there is water in the solution tank. Check the water pipe is connected properly and not kinked. If there isn't any water flow, remove the water pipe from the solution tank valve and pull the water lever. If there is water flow, there is a blockage in the water pipe. Clean the water pipe and replace. If there is still no water flow, there is a blockage in the solution tank. Empty and clean the solution tank and replace. If you need further assistance, please contact your local service agent or email service at truevox.com.